Carmelo Anthony, you know, got into it with Chris Anderson a little bit in game four and uh, had some comments after the game uh, that were somewhat controversial. But he said, everything is cool with me and my teammates heading into game five. He sinks the jumper right there. That was the eighth lead change of the first quarter. Denver led by one. D. Will sinks the three. Utah by three. Denver responds. It's J.R. Smith to Kenyon Martin. These two guys right here need to be aggressive. You see J.R. attacking the basket, four, making four guys play them. You know you're making your teammates better. Aaron Aflalo. I said the money ball. He's five of five for the night, folks. He was. Two of two from deep. Five of five from the floor. Twelve points. D. I love it when you're on the stats like that. Carlos Boozer. And one, he would miss the free throw. Denver by four. Now, bad news for the Nuggets. Nene, watch ah. his knee. It was planting, and it got kicked at the same time. That is wrong place, wrong time. And Ooh. Nene did not return to the basketball game, and he was such a warrior all year for Denver. We can just cross our fingers and hope this is not a long-term injury. Boozer hits the fadeaway. Denver still led by one, and then D. Will doing his thing. Let's say D. Will got busy tonight, folks. <laughs> 34 and 10 and some major history that we'll tell you about in a moment. Chauncey picks up the loose ball, walks into that three. That's vintage Chauncey. Yes, he'll, he'll take that shot all day and say, what, layup? Oh, this is a layup. Chauncey to the mellow man. I heard a tweet. Get him to the line. Give me the ball. It's time for Bully Man to take over. Oh. Hey, get my shorts oh. back. Get in my shorts back. Oh. CJ, come on. This stop. isn't football. Bully. <laughs> Darren Williams to Carlos Boozer. I've seen that several hundred times. Boozer and Darren Williams came to play. And then you've got Darren Williams to Paul Millsap for the slam. And this was the point of the game when Utah was getting everything they wanted right at the rim. We were watching in the gearing room. They would be more aggressive and taking everything to the rim. Ty Lawson for three. Uh, he takes a four-point game to a seven-point lead for Denver. That was large. So was Lawson to Chris Anderson. Uh, Lawson was huge. I mean, if you're talking about Chauncey Billups. I'm being in foul trouble, but the young fella came in, held, held serve. He was aggressive. He did a decent job on Darren Williams, even though he had great numbers. Utah's not done. Paul Millsap puts it in. The feed from Darren Williams. We got a three-point game. Dennis, speaking of threes. Can we say money ball, folks? His mama calls him Earl. Someone call him Earl now. <laughs> Darren Williams here loses the ball, and it leads to J.R. Smith getting busy. Oh, yes. That's JR. <laughs> I am the slam dunk champ. In game. Very nice. I'm that, that's, that would get a 50. <laughs> what? I'm telling you, that's an in game 50 right there from JR Smith. No, nah, I'm going to give that a 48 because I think right before the playoffs, he had that uh, 360 okay. alley oop in the game. That's a 50. And that was against my <laughs> wolves, if I'm not mistaken. It sure was.